all my friends, it's a tight schedule between Morocco and Portugal. Hmm. The Moroccans not only escaped, but still we don't know how they will survive against Portugal. Wow. But I got five tips. The five ways Morocco can use to beat Portugal. Number one, hold the testicle tight. In Africa, we believe that when you hold your testicle so tight, tight, chances are bad luck will not follow you. And if the Moroccan players and fans can hold it, surely it will happen. The only way is the Moroccan players should do it before the match. Then the fans should do it for more than 90 minutes. Number two, whoa, 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 whoa. Ha, I guess this is too true. Bring the beautiful girls from Africa. <laughs> you may be wondering that something is not tricky there. The girls from Africa have bigger curves than the white people. So there are possibilities that the likes of Ronaldo, Gonzalo, the guy who has been chased by Arsenal but in vain. And <laughs> as a reminder, Arsenal have been told that the price of yesterday is not the price of tomorrow. So, these players will divert their focus onto the beautiful girls. Then, onto another tip, which is the third one. Apply juju. Intense African magic needs to be applied if Morocco should beat the Portuguese. Otherwise, it will not be easy. This will need maybe more than 10 witch doctors for enough spiritual cleansing. Then, number four, just like the pass, pack the bus and we do the hard way in the penalty so that the juju may help them fly out their penalties outside. Just like uh, you have seen in the previous game. Then, last but not least, which is number five, just in case you miss the ball, never miss the leg. So if you miss the ball, and you miss the lake, Portugal is out. That is the trick. Take it or leave it. Bye-bye.